Hi everyone, today's topic is min and max function in Power BI desktop. First we understand why we use min function. Min function returns the smallest value in a column or between two scalar expressions. And max function returns the largest value in a column or between two scalar expressions. Okay. Let's do it practically in Power BI. Let's open Power BI. Let me get the data. Select the table name and load. Data is loaded. Click on the data view. This is uh, the employee data. Uh, here we have employee ID, department, location, employee name, and salary. Okay, we are using min function first. It returns the smallest value in a column. This is the salary column. In this salary column, min function returns the smallest value. Okay, smallest value it returns. Okay, uh, go to report view. Right click here, just uh, select new measure. Now we are using min function. Okay, just name it as uh, min here. Min of we have to select the column. We are looking for smallest value in this salary column. Okay, so my column name is salary. Close the parenthesis, enter. Okay, measure is created. Just take card visualization and just drag this measure into the card visualization. Okay, the smallest minimum, minimum value is 6960 okay just I will apply the border okay now we are going to use max function just right click here and select new measure okay I'm naming as measure max because we are using max function here so max of column name is salary I want to know the max highest value in a salary column okay so I am selecting salary column and close the parenthesis enter here max measure is created just take the card visualization and just drag into this card visualization okay just go to format and just apply the border on okay here it is showing as 72k I want full round amount so just go to data level display units change it to none so I am getting full amount here so the max amount is 71,850 in this column salary column here it is 71,850 minimum amount is 6,960 this is the minimum amount 6,960 okay for this reason we use min and max function in Power BI desktop. Hope you understand this. In next video, we will cover some more DAX functions. Thank you for watching my video. Please like and subscribe if you like the video.